Hello everyone, Craig Basher here, uh, application engineer for Advanced Solutions. Well, 2012 product is here, and most people want to know what's new. So, over the next few posts, I'd like to show a little bit about what's new. The first thing that I'm going to show you is about the right click menu. It hasn't gone away, it's still there, but it's now called the marking menu. When I right click it, I get the marking menu and this is the menu mode when I right click it I get the menu and I pick the command that I want to use now this marking menu is just really to keep me right here in the graphics area now as I design I can still do the things that I did last year I can still use the heads up display create the data create my geometry What's nice about the marking menu is it has another mode. It has also what we call the, the mark mode. And that basically means that I can create a gesture. So the thing about that is that you kind of have to remember where those commands are. So instead of having to right click, pause, pick on, extrusion, I can actually just kind of right click and hold it down and swipe to what I would call the two o'clock and it would automatically create that little sweep and go right onto that command. So now I pick on my uh, profiles here. Something else that's brand new is they've updated the little mini toolbar. It's got some more commands right here at my fingertips. And also my dialog boxes are automatically hidden. And whatever I did in the dialog box I can now do right here on my screen. So I'm done with that. I want to right click and say OK. I'm still getting used to it, but that's a nice little tool. Now, I like to show one other thing, kind of a, something kind of exciting. Every year, they add a new little tool in the visualization side of Inventor. Now, they have this new thing called ray tracing. Now, ray tracing means that a model can reflect upon itself. So, for instance, I have this decal. And then I want to see the decal on the bottom side of this face. All I have to do is turn that on. It will enable that ray tracing. And now I have that reflection. Hope all is well. Glad you enjoyed the tip. See you all next time.